Hi everyone, this is Kathy. Welcome to my channel, Kathy Mamelin Psychic Medium. This is for all signs, any sign of the person that you're thinking of. These are just love messages, love message note cards. So we're just going to see what spirit has for you. We're just going to see a handful of messages your person has for you today. If you enjoy this type of reading, please let me know in the comments. I'm looking forward to getting some feedback from you, but let's see what love messages that we have for their honest feelings during a no contact. Let's see what they want to say. I promise I'm coming home. Don't give up on me. I'm sorry I risk losing your love. I love the compass. I feel like the compass is guiding you guys, like their inner compass is saying, you know, I'm sorry I risked losing your love. I'm, I'm sorry that I risked it all. Would you ever be able to forgive all my mistakes? Could you ever truly trust me? I feel like we want to say again, you know, can we have trust again? Are you going to forgive me? Are we going to be able to get through something? I'm afraid to open up. I know it will be the end of my ability to keep these walls up. I'm just protecting my heart. It really isn't you. It's me. So this person is struggling with their own feelings. They're not putting any blame on you. They're struggling with their own feelings in this connection. I will always forgive the mistakes that you make. It's almost a feeling of if I can forgive, can you forgive? Like we both have to kind of meet each other halfway is how I feel. I talk to you all the time. I express everything I feel and desire as if you were here. So I'm reaching out to you. I'm trying to talk to you. I hope you're listening. I hope that you can hear me. I hope you can sense me as all the feelings that I'm getting right now. I'm sorry I never gave you any closure, but I don't want this to end. I feel I need you in my life to some degree or it will all fall apart. You know, I wasn't expecting this to end completely. Sometimes people push another person away and then they're surprised that that person's no longer communicating with them and, and they've been pulled out of their life, even when it was them that wanted it. I'm working my ass off to become a man, the man of your dreams. I'm trying harder. I'm working harder. I'm working towards something. The reason I come and go is because I just can't stay away, but I'm not ready to give all I know you deserve. So I run. There's a sense of fear. Please don't give up on us. I promise I will be back soon. Beautiful. I will be back to tell you the truth. I can't keep these feelings inside of myself anymore. So that's what we want. We want to hear the truth. We want this person to come forward. We want this person to be able to communicate with us and share with us what it is that they're thinking and feeling. Spirit, please share with us other feelings coming from the person that we're thinking of right now. What is it that we need to hear? You are so sweet. So there's a part of them that's just thinking about the good times. They're thinking about how much they cared about you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I hurt you. Love yourself unconditionally. While I'm away, I want you to take care of yourself. I want you to put yourself first. I want you to be good to yourself. I don't want you to beat yourself up over this connection. It's not you. It's me. They had already said. So take care of yourself. I'm not worthy of your love. So they're working on themselves. There's a sense of, I still need time to work on myself. I still have to figure things out. This was a blessing in disguise. Maybe this time alone or this time apart is allowing us to grow. It's allowing us to see the truth in this relationship. It's allowing us both to heal. I'm working towards being with you. I do feel like this person's putting in an effort. I feel like this person is realizing that they've got some work to do. And in order to return to this connection, they've really got to put the time into themselves. My heart is yours. I feel like this person wants to let you know I'll love you no matter what. Even when I'm not with you, I still love you. I don't want you to think that I don't love you. I'm just not with you right now. Tough times are stopping this connection. I'm trying to get myself in a better place. 
I'm trying to fix my finances or I'm trying to work through some things that I have been struggling with for so long. And I feel like you know what those things are. So I guess give them a chance to work through some of those things. I want to be in your life. They've made up their mind. They still want you in their life. There's still a part of them that says, I, I want you to be a part of my life. Things are complicated. I need them to get simpler. I need to get some things off my plate. I need to be able to breathe. I need to be able to take care of what I need to take care of first before you are in my life. It hurts when you're not with me. I'm hurting also. So there's definitely a feeling of I'm hurting. I'm sad. Do what makes you happy. They really want you to be happy while you're waiting. They don't want to be you know, sad that it, they're making it even worse. They want you to feel like you're taking care of yourself, that you're good to yourself. Um, so this person isn't looking to hurt you even more. I think about you, marrying you. I feel like I, this is something that someday, it's like a someday, if I can heal, if I can get better, we can be together. I want to give you more. I feel like I just can't give you what you deserve or what you need from me right now. This connection is damaged. I feel like I've damaged this connection. I have struggled with this nonstop, nonstop thinking about you, what I could have done differently, what we could do differently, how we could heal. So you've got somebody that's that's trying to do some work in this connection and trying to figure this out. My love is unconditional. So I do feel for you. I am connecting to you. So let's put this out into the universe just for today. I just wanted to give you some additional love messages. I want to thank Spirit for this these messages. If you're new to my channel, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you for your comments. Let me know if you enjoy these mini messages or these types of readings. If anyone would like to book a private reading with me, please check out my website at kathymamelinpsychicmedium.com.